Eric. Nothing. G me. Boyd. Proud of you, man. The who? The what? The droid? That's not me. No, no, oh, G -boy. G -boy. Oh, these? G -boy. Oh, G -boy. He was being funny, dude. Land Rover. Oh, oh. You're right. Well, the Land Rover's coming along, finally. <laughs> Uh, the 124 scale Itulary Land Rover, yay. Uh, yeah, so we got the, final, the paint's all done as far as that's concerned. Uh, the rack is just dry fit and uh, I've been playing around with some of the shading on, I don't know what the heck this is, a raft or whatever, but anyway. Coffins. Yeah, coffins. It's a dead body in there. Or three of them. three yeah. three because it looks that way. And, uh, while stuff has been drying, I've been kind of working on the gas cans, and uh, which these aren't actually on. They didn't come with uh, the kit. There is one gas can. It's really kind of tiny, but I got those aftermarket because um, I wanted to put extra on there. Um, and I'm going to do something kind of different with the front of it because um, I found some pictures of some other uh, Land Rovers. and. Out in the field, they kind of retrofit the bumpers to do some really cool stuff with the gas cans. They actually uh, mount them up front so they could just kind of go up up to the bumper and just kind of they they tie tie them on some somehow with straps. So I'm actually going to scratch build uh, some uh, uh, some trays that just uh, mount on the front of the bumpers. So you just kind of lift them up there and um, build some straps. To strap it down. It looks really cool. Uh, th there's a big bull bar that goes on the front of it. I don't really like it, so I'm just going to leave it kind of clean like that and just put the gas cans on front. Um, I think it looks really clean like that, and then it's just going to get really dirty. And hopefully, those purple? No, not on those. Not on those. Uh, those you could run. Uh, apparently, you could run without a snorkel. They could get wet and, and muddy, and you didn't even need a snorkel for them. So. Um, and then I have an issue with the door. I need to figure out uh, how to do some hinges for the back door. You just leave it off and put like a you spin it? Uh, thing on the back. Yeah? You you spin it there? Thing. No, like a, what's that? For the driver it's a, thing. It's a cargo net? Or yeah, like a cargo net or something. Right. Like that. That's actually not a bad idea. I like that. Get an antelope back. Call it yeah. 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 Can do something. something. Can, um, can you spin it so I can get the back? Oh, thing. sure. Oh no, Clay, just go ahead and knock over my uh, dreadnought while you're trying to get the photographs. I'm not, I'm not touching Clay anything. Water. Relax, relax. <laughs> How much that cost? 200 bucks? <laughs> I got a deal for it, but I know why I got the deal for it. And then, so um, I, and then the other, uh, homemade rose and coffee. the other, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of disappointed that Don's not here because I wanted to show him that I actually have pretty much half the Merc done. <laughs> Uh, that's the one, that's the main 135th scale, um, recovery.